What's up guys, welcome back to Thousand Year Door Hardcore Mode, we're doing Bowser's Intermission and in the last episode, I failed to cook potions. A lot. Lek, what is this place? Why is the light so weird here? Spooking me out! The light thought because this is Twilight Town, my lord. Should be treasure here. Let's put the screws to one of these creepy things and find the crystal star. It sounds good to me, Haggy. Let's go to it. Who's this guy? Oh man. I'm pretty sure Beldum said she lost her super bomb somewhere around here. This stinks. Really, this whole deal is, uh, is extremely bad, 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 bad. I gotta cowboy up and make a serious comeback here or else. Oh. Oh god, has he found it? He found it! Bam! Got it! I am the man! Now we can crush Mario and get the crystal stars in one fell swoop. Hot diggity dog! Whoa, whoa, whoa! The luck of the moon is still riding shotgun with me! You there, let's switch this guy. You know something about the crystal stars, don't you? Whoa, somebody there? Hey, what's the big idea, turtle boy? You looking for the crystal stars too? Sweet, this will help the crump come back. Now then, let's get to it. You'll be telling me everything you know. Now. Oh, actually, it's you who's going to spill every bit of info out of your big ugly head. Yeah, sorry about that. And if you hesitate at all, I'll show you no mercy. Whoa there, big guy. I mean, no, wait. What am I afraid of? You? If you think you can take me, then try it, chubby. All troops, report! Oh, no. Ooh. Yeah, you like that? Kind of a lot of dudes, huh? You feel like talking yet? <laughs> you dare scoff at us? Koopa Clan, form up! Oh my god, the war begins! Whoa, well played. <laughs> so what's it gonna be, tough guy? Boo-hoo. <laughs> Oh, I gotta laugh. This is why I keep one of these rounds. Sorry, suckers. Eat this, turtle dorks. Super ba bomb Incoming! Huh? That was it? That was your big weapon? It didn't even go off. Whoa. This is how you do it, amateur. Watch and learn. Uh, Bowser. Oh, crud. Uh, Bowser. What did you do? Oh, my God. Oh, no. Nice. Well, okie doke. We did some things. You, you have distinguished yourself in battle, amigo. You are worthy in my eyes. You may use this ship, the Black Skull, any time you like. Ah, many thanks to you. This ship can get us back to Roadport in no time. Let us get away from this coconut pit and back home. Come, everybody. Ah, I can't wait to get home. We've been looking forward to this for so long. Returning home alive is all the treasure I need. For real. Now get this boat moving. Well, that is all there is to it, then. Am I not correct? To see, Captain Mario. Ah, oh, Mario. Oh, yeah. We're going to stay here. It's been tough at times, but I think we like this place. Yes, I think I can make a fine life here with my sweet Frankie. Hey Mario, give my regard to the boss, will you? Yeah, I'm gonna stay here. It's a right nice place to live without any ghosts, eh? I'm sure they'll be alright here, don't you think? Let's leave, Mario. Ready, amigos? Cast off. Oh, never mind. I think we have to come back here later, so... I'll come and get whack bombs later. One star, day circle. And thus our adventure came to an exciting end, ah? The, sh the ship sailed smoothly onto a rope port, and soon we saw the harbour off our bow. I did not find treasure, but I am satisfied nonetheless, strange though it sounds. For I have found something even more precious than doubloons, yes. Even now I hear the crew readying to dock. The time is ripe to close this journal. To all who wander the seas, Flavio's blessing upon you. Flavio. At last we return, slathered in glory, to my hometown, Sweet Roadport. Of course, it's only because of my courageous efforts that we return at all, huh? But of course, you all know that and know it well. Yes, yes, Master Flavio. But now, please excuse us. Perhaps chance will bring us all together again someday. Hopefully without Flavio. 
What? Hey, what? you're all leaving already? Ah, that was harsh. Such is life, Captain Mario. You're anxious to continue your own adventure also, huh? Yes, move out the fucking way. One day you may surpass the great and fabulous Flavio in greatness and fabulousness. <laughs> it is not likely, I assure you, but you should. How you say, shoot for the stars, huh? If ever you should reach the pinnacle, remember to shout Flavio to the wind. That reminds me, amigo. If you ever get the urge to return to Keelhaw Key, just say the word, okay? I will send you to the island faster than the fastest winds blow, comprende? Yes, yes, you giant skull, you. Your time in the spotlight is done. Get over yourself. He will kill you. Ahem. Well, my adoring fans have gone, so I will be excusing myself now as well. If you see me in town, I would permit you to say hello to me. Maybe meet again, huh? Never. So, Mario, don't you think maybe we should go too? Maybe go to the door? That is correct. That is where we're going to go, actually. As it goes. <gasps> oh, Mario, listen. That must be an email from Princess Peach. It must. Dearest Mario, I have good news. I don't know where I'm being held, but there's an odd computer called Tech here. You're only just telling me this now. By cooperating with this Tech, I've managed to obtain some of these fiends' data. Tech is currently analysing it, and strange as it may sound, I trust him. Once his analysis is done, I should be able to provide you with details of their plans. I'll email you again once I learn more. Be good, okay? P Princess Peach. Oh my, that princess of yours is so courageous. We better get to work too. I swear to God, Peach, you better not be cheating on me with that computer. Also, Vivian, don't get jealous. Don't worry, girl. I'm not even a fan of Princess Peach that much anyway. Shush. Shush. Alright, shush. <laughs> we'll just, we'll just, just, we'll do some things. Don't worry. I wonder if this guy has what I want. There's a thing I need to... Yes, it's here. This is going to, this double pain badge is going to be in a future challenge. So I thought I'd buy it now. Yes, I'll take it. If you know if you know what it does, then you know what's in store for me. If you don't know what it does, then well, you guys are in for a bit of a surprise. I mean, it's obvious what it does. It's, it's called double pain. Think about it. But that's going to be in a future challenge. But that's not important right now. For now, to the thousand year door, we must travel. Ah oh, yes, pit of a hundred trials. Is this like the third time? This has got to be the third time we've passed this place. Yeah, definitely third time. Alrighty, where are we gonna go? Ooh. Looks like Rome. Looks very Roman with its big, like, Romaniness. That made sense. What have you got to say, Vivian? What do you reckon? All set, and let's go see Professor Frankly. Oh yeah. Yes, let's. Great news, my friends! The next crystal star is in partially heights. Why is Merlin outside? Don't know. Hang on, haven't I heard that lots of rich and famous people call that place home? Yes, yes, and I'm fairly sure there's also a shrine to the stars called Partially Sanctum. No fear some monsters or dangerous sentence either. It's just a tourist attraction. Partially height, huh? Okay, how do we get there? That's not, that's the best part. You ride the most famous train of all, the XS Express. Yes, after a luxurious tree steam engine excursion, the next crystal star will be yours. Getting those crystal stars has been a back-breaking work, but this time will be a cinch. Well, they let us on board. I heard you have to be rich or famous to get a seat. Hmm, that may be true. Perhaps you should ask Don Pianta for help with this too. Are you kidding? Everyone says he's an awful man. Doesn't he extort people? Well, I guess we don't have much choice now, do we? Let's do this quickly. Oh, yeah. Alright. Excellent, then we're set. We may not have much time left, so you must hurry. I'll gather all the information I can. You guys just handle your end of things. Oh my, Vivian has... Um, no grump? Yeah. Vivian, not mech. Freaking, what's his face? Yeah. Merlon. Oh, an impeccable timing. Yes, this was distant. When I get sold in my star charts, I saw a portentous sign for you, Mario. It went thusly. In the house of the dragon that flew through the air, beyond the reversible stair. Near the empty black chest that cursed you lies a clue to help your allies learn. I have no idea what it means, unfortunately, but I have no doubt of its importance as a sign for you and your friends. If you figure out this mystery, come and tell me immediately. 
We will do. It basically wants you to go to Hooktail Castle and do a thing. I don't know if we're going to do that. It lets you upgrade your partner like a second time. Let's upgrade Bobbery. So like... Sure. And we can upgrade Flurry as well, I guess. I think if we get into s s trouble and like... It becomes almost impossible without leveling up my partners. Then maybe I'll do it. But I really don't want to. Quite frankly. Yeah, let's power up some more. Let's get Flurry up. Power up my boobs! Power up my boob lady! We have a name for Flurry as well. We have Butt Traitor and Boob... Boob lady. Or Boob Traitor. We got butts and boobs, everybody. We got butts and boobs. Oh my god. I don't even know. Thank you. Now we leave. Uh, right, I want to leave Vivian out. And we're going to go to Don Pianta. See what's going on. What's going on, guys? How's it going? Oh no, what the hell? Francesca. Oh, poor boss. The big man's been sick with loneliness ever since his daughter skedaddled. Our underboss, Frankie, is gone. The boss is in shambles. What's the syndicate to do? That scruffy gang of punk thieves is stealing jobs from us right and left. Hey, but enough about us and our stupid problems, huh? What can we do for you? What? Tickets for the richest train around? For the XS Express? Whoa, you want tickets for that rolling wing ding? Yes. Ooh, ain't nothing we can do about that. Yeah, I was giving that tickets. That's rich. You gotta talk to the boss for that. Francesca. I just can't stand seeing the boss like this. If we just knew where those newlyweds was, we could take the boss to see him. You mean that cute couple Frankie and Francesca? Were they on Keel Hall Key? Who's on to what now? What did you say? Repeat that. You know where the young Miss Pianta is at? Really? No lie? I swear to you, if you're lying, we I will turn you into confetti, so help me. Jesus. Yeah, well, uh, cool, chill. We know where they are. Well, if that's where she is, why don't you bring her back here, huh? Be a pal. We go ourselves, but we can't leave the boss unprotected, you get me? Yeah, you bring us young Miss Francesca. And we'll do what we can to get you your train tickets. We... You got a deal or what? Sure, yeah. I'll do it. See, now that's better. I knew once you understood our predicament, you couldn't refuse. Don't screw this up. And we're not going to screw this up in the next episode. If you enjoyed this episode, please like, comment, and subscribe. And in the next episode, we're going to go get Frankie and Francesca to come back here. See you later, guys.